Hello everyone, today I'm going to talk about this. So over here is the octopus. Around it is surround by coral and seaweed. You might wonder how to do the waves. So you just roll them both sharp up, then um, pull them up like that. You might see this little white wave. I always keep as much space between those curls as possible to look to make it look really cool. You might know just the coral leaves and the um, seaweed all have rocks under it because it is actually it's going to be attached like that. So just squish it together. But if you just don't have rocks, it will still be like that. So you know. So it won't look good. This is actually a one minute timer, but I'm going to. I went to see and it, it, if it was right, but it was only twenty six seconds, which is pretty fast. Um. So for these holes, I use the the tip of it, the pen, like it circles, so it's like that. The coral leaf. Like a long, a short carrot, then uh, smash it all the way, twist it. These oh, curl was um, roll them kind of into a raindrop or like something like, but shorter than the seaweed. Poke a hole on the top, just like that. So you can see the details of this thing. Stand it down, and you'll see it. So the down is most mainly where it's color better. On the top, it's mainly waves and bubbles. So it's kind of like aquarium. So you see, there is two type of tool to do this in a measuring spoon. Yeah, you use clay. So, thanks everyone to listening to this video, and don't forget to please subscribe.